foot grinder attachment. First, loosen the hub knob. Take out the hub cover. Insert the spiral housing and tighten the hub knob. Insert the spiral completely into the spiral housing. Make sure the flat surface of the blade faces outward before connecting it with the spiral. Choose your desired grinding disc and insert into the spiral housing. Then, secure with lock nut. Place the food tray on the filler neck. Start preparing the meat by cutting it into pieces about 2.5 cm in length. Make sure the meat do not contain any bones or sinew. Turn on your mixer, then choose your desired speed. Feed the meat into the filler neck for grinding. Use a presser if needed. Shape the mincemeat into a patty or meatballs. Enjoy them with extra ingredients and sauces. Sausage attachment. Loosen the hub knob, take out the hub cover. Insert the spiral housing and tighten the hub knob. Insert the spiral completely into the spiral housing. Connect the cookie connector with the spiral. Attach to the small sausage stuffer and secure it with the lock nut. Place the food tray on the filler neck. Insert the sausage casing and tie a knob at the end of it. Fill up the filler neck and food tray with meats before stuffing to avoid air bubbles inside the casing. Choose your desired speed. Start stuffing the meat by using the presser. Put your finger at the opening and hold the casing throughout the process. Use a needle or pricker and start poking the sausage to eliminate the air in the sausage. Twist the sausage two or three times to make the links. For the following link, twist the opposite way. Cookie attachment. Loosen the hub knob, take out the hub cover. Insert the spiral housing and tighten the hub knob. Insert the spiral completely into the spiral housing. Attach the cookie connector to spiral. Attach the pattern housing to spiral housing and secure with a lock nut. And place the pattern plate into the pattern housing. Start the mixer and feed the dough from the top using the presser.